properties of the roots of quadratic equations. Here is an application for the same. Find the equation whose roots are the squares of the reciprocal of the roots of x squared plus 6x minus 2 equals to 0. So let's write down this equation in terms of its roots, right? And then we'll solve it. So we have x squared plus 6x minus 2 equals to 0. In terms of its roots, we can write this as x squared. I should write x1, x2 as with minus x1 plus x2. These are the two roots times x plus x1, x2 equals to 0. So that is the equation in terms of its roots, which are x1 and x2. Now, if you compare this, then what we really get here is that x1 and x2 is equal to minus 6. Sum of these two roots is minus 6, and the product of these two roots is minus 2. So that is what is given to us. Now the question is, find the equation whose roots are the squares of reciprocal of the roots. So squares of the reciprocal of the roots will be kind of like this. That means x square minus of, when we say squares of the reciprocal, the reciprocal is 1 over x1. So we are expecting here 1 over x1, I mean x1 square plus 1 over x2 square times x plus when we do squares of the reciprocal then be 1 over x1 x2 whole square equals to 0. So that is the required equation for us. This is what we need to find. So let's solve for this. So x1 plus x2 is minus 6. x1 times x2 is 0. We need to find what is sum of their reciprocal squares? That is, what is 1 over x1 square plus 1 over x2 square equals to? Now, we can take common denominator and we get x1 square times x2 square. And the numerator will be x2 square plus x1 square. Now, in this case, what is x2 square plus x1 square? It could be written as x1 plus x2 whole square minus 2x1 x2, right? So we can write this as x1 plus x2 whole square minus 2 times x1 x2 divided by x1 square times x2 square. So that is what we get, right? And let's try to solve this now. So let's take it here and then solve it. So I'll use a different ink now. x1 plus x2 whole square. Now x1 plus x2 is minus 6. So we get minus 6 whole square and minus 2 times x1 x2. Minus 2 times x1 x2 is equals to minus 2. divided by x1 x2 whole square that means minus 2 whole square so that is what we get here so this is equal to 36 plus 4 over 4 which is 40 over 4 which is equals to 10 so we get 1 over the sum of these squares is indeed equals to 10 right so that is the first part which we could do here. Now let's see what is the product. That means 1 over x1 x2 whole square is equal to what? We know x1 and x2 is, I should have written minus 2 here, x1 and x2 is minus 2, so it is 1 over minus 2 whole square, which is indeed 1 over 4. So their product is 1 over 4. Now, since we know this, we can substitute these values and get our equation. And therefore, the equation should be 
x square minus sum of roots. So sum of roots is 10 x plus product. Product of x1, x2 is 1 over 4. So we get 1 over 4 equals to 0. Now we can multiply by 4 and we get 4x square minus 40x plus 1 equals to 0. So that becomes our answer. So that is the answer which we get for the given question. I hope you appreciate the method. It is. Write down the equation, find the relate equation with its roots. So we get sum and product of roots from the equation. Sum is minus 6 and the product is minus 2. From here we can find sum and product of the new equation and then get our equation, right? So as done here. I hope that helps. Thank you.